Well, the keyboard is out and it is hiding something rather nasty. The battery has gone completely bad in this and has leaked quite a lot over the board. Now, at least this is the digital section. I mean, I my other sort of hobby is repairing arcade machines, so I actually know what these chips are. They're fairly standard um, mid 1980s uh, hardware. Uh, the little chip uh, next to the battery is just a 74 series uh, buffer. That's a normal 6116 um, static RAM. And that, I think, is another sort of uh, static RAM. I'd have to check the number on that, but uh, I'm pretty sure I've got those on some scrap boards. Um, it may actually not be as bad as it looks. I mean, I can clean all that off. Uh, if there were cut tracks, I would expect this thing to boot and just give rubbish on the screen and do nothing at all. So uh, it is still alive, but obviously in need of some uh, some TLC. And uh, as you can see, it does say Alpha Juno 2, as expected. Uh, in terms of the keyboard itself, uh, I haven't really looked much more at that, but. Uh, I would assume that the damage to both the keyboard and the board actually is probably due to liquid coming onto the the keyboard itself. It seems to be rust more than corrosion. I mean, the battery is going clearly, but it has leaked a bit. But uh, uh, looking for a common cause, the simplest simplest answer to any of these problems is one bad thing happened rather than two: um, a broken track on the keyboard, keyboard PCB, and that corrosion could well be from the same place. So I'm going to take that board out and have a closer look at it and uh, see what I can do.